Right, so here we are in the uh, quality control lab, the Q lab, and I'm sat next to the lovely uh, Marianne. And, uh, what uh, Marianne does is she's a Q grader for Master Roast, or for the coffee company here. Uh, she's also involved with the SCAE, she also does the Q grading, uh, so all the quality checks, and she's looking at some coffees in here. So just explain what you do in here and uh, why you do it for me. So we, you're currently in the QC at the moment, and we are currently roasting a coffee sample, which just happens to be decaf, CO2 decaf process. Um, and Anna is, if I'm being honest, more the person who's keeping an eye on this. But um, the idea for this is that we want to basically produce the, the best flavours and tastes that represent this particular coffee, which is a Peru CO2 decaf, okay. um, for the particular uh, customer who it's for. So um, we want to basically make sure that we, we drop the coffee in at the right temperature and that we also moderate the temperature the whole way through. Because at key stages during this, we're going to have different chemical reactions and those are going to develop essentially the, the key aromas and flavours of this coffee. So we don't want it in this particular case too dark or too developed. Okay. So when we get to the first crack, which is going to be basically the, um, what you're going to see, not only colour changes, you're going to hear the changes, but you're also going to experience the... Um, the, uh, the bean, basically, okay. yep. the evaporization of moisture. Okay. And it's like uh, popcorn, isn't it? It's like, like popcorn, popcorn yeah, expands, like pop, all the moisture pop, pop, pop. comes out. So we've still got a bit of a way to go on yep. this particular one, but decaf is always a bit of a weird one to roast, especially when you compare it to coffees that haven't actually been processed in this manner. But um, if you could smell this, yep. then you'd be smelling That's potentially smell hay, bready things. Well, yeah, exactly. Okay. Um, but and if you can see this, we'll take a little sample out now. We're starting to get through, you know, it's starting to spelch slightly. Okay. Uh, and kind of changes, yep. and then we'll put that back in. And how long, was, how long will that take? If we just uh, to be fair, we need a cooling process as well. Is anything up to 15 minutes, all in total. Okay. Uh, 10 minutes to 9 minutes for the main roast, okay. and then... And then if you're acceptable with that, and that gets signed off by you in this room Correct. here. Yes, and it gets tasted off, tasted um, uh, and yeah, to make sure and that it goes it's not... into production. Yeah, right. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Wonderful. Okay. Yeah, Thank you, good. Buddy. You're welcome. Okay.